Now look, we got the homie J. Cole in the building, man. First off, man, th and thanks for you and Drizzy Drake. Y'all bring your light scared brothers back, man. You know, Leave the back, charge, man. my dude. You no, know, we back, man. You know, I'll be sure to set us back. You know, so far. <laughs> That's right, get stabbed in the head, man. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Yo, what, what's good though, man? Let everybody know, man. Got the new joint, who that man? Yeah. Club banging right now, G. I mean, what, what's good? You, you signed to Jay Z, man. Yeah. That that right there in itself, man. That, that puts so much pressure, I think, on somebody. Yeah, it does. But you know what? I always tell everybody every time. Like I already had pressure on myself. Like whether I was signed to Jay Z or Jay Quan, like I still feel pressure because right. I want to put out the best material that I can put out. You know what I'm saying? I had a high expectation for my album before I was ever signed. So. I got pressure regardless, you know, Jay-Z or uh, no Jay-Z. Right. Now, did he put pressure on you? Did he say, like, you know, or is he cool as a boss? How he's is he? cool. He's, he's real cool, but he definitely does challenge you. I would say that about him. That's probably one of the best things. He's like one of them coaches that challenge you okay. to, to go as far as you can go and never settle. So, you know, he definitely puts uh, puts some motivation in him. All right, now, this is the thing. Now, what, what actually got you saying? I mean, it just popped up. You're the artist. You yeah. were with Jay-Z, Rock Nation, and, and now... And now uh, it's like, we, how did it happen, fam? Yeah, well, I mean, it's a long story. I went, in, I moved to New York. I'm from North Carolina. Okay. I moved to New York when I was 18, just trying to, you know, trying to get on and make a long story short. It took me a long time, but Mark Pitts, who was Biggie's manager, right. heard Lights Please, well, actually played Lights Please for Jay-Z. And once Jay heard Lights Please, the song I got, he was just like, man, bring this kid to me. And, you know, I was nervous. I didn't really believe it was about to happen, but... I met with him and the rest was history. He wanted to sign me. So did you believe Mark at first or he was like, hey man, we gotta meet with Jay? -Z. I didn't hear from him. I, I heard from uh from this dude Kirk Lightburn who, you know, related to Mark. He told me, so I ain't believe him. Uh -huh. And Mark yeah. would tell me how to believe, but I ain't believe him. I was like, man, come on. Right, 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 right. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't do me like that. But it turned out to be true. So did you move to New York just for that? Like, just for the, just for the music, man. I went to school in New York, but that was just my that was my ticket. I mean I was gonna go to school anyway. But that was my ticket to get to New York right, and to be right. around the music. Yeah, you graduated right. from St. John's, St. Right? John's University, man. All right, all right. congratulations yes, on that, Thank G. No much, doubt, man. no doubt. Hey, man, more to count down coming up. J. Yeah, Cole, the, the Twitter, the, the, just the, the whole, really, man, you kind of, I want to say underground, but just like, man, you've been bubbling for a minute. Like, exactly. before, the, before the Who That record came out, yeah. you had a couple couple hot mixtapes, yeah. you, you know, freshman class, you was on the, on the cover, what was it, Double XL? Yeah, you? it was Double XL on the source. <laughs> I got that source covered, but really, it's like you said, man, I mean, it ain't necessarily underground, it's just under the radar. Yeah, that's what I'm you know, saying, it's yeah. Just, it's just, it's at that level where it's just about to boil over the top, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. So that's where we at right now, we just at that level where we just a half step away yeah. from getting to that next level. All right. And it's beautiful, because it's all going naturally. Mm -hmm. You not only, like, you know what I'm saying, uh, you know, perform, but you produce too. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. I be forgetting to tell people that. I, <laughs> I always forget. Like, I seen somebody today. He was like, man, did you produce this one song I just put out, Premeditate Money? Like, uh -huh. did, you, did you produce that? I'm like, yeah. He's like, you know, the reaction is crazy. But I forget. I'm such a rapper. I forget to tell people that I be producing these songs, too. Uh -huh. I wish I was like Kanye and I could just, you right. know, he, yeah, he know how to self-promote. He gonna let you know right off the top. Like, right, right, I did right. it all. Right. No doubt, man. I mean, so how does it feel? You you actually around everybody who's on tour, went on tour with Jay, the yeah. whole thing, man. How how, how is all that going, crazy. man? That's, it's got to be yeah. crazy for man, you. I was right crazy, now. dog. I was fresh in the game too, and and, and got to open up for him. Then come out every night and do Stars Born. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And, and performing in front of twenty thousand people was crazy. But what I really got from it was just I learned from him as a performer. Uh -huh. Okay. I took little things from him. If you watch my show now, you see a lot of his mannerisms. It's yeah. just natural. Right, right. He's around him so much. Exactly. We see somebody perform for that. Just like if you're around somebody and they talk a certain way, you know what I'm saying? You yeah, might just pick up the, the, the slang, slang and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. So it's like that. All right, all right, man. Where, where can people get in tune with you, though, as far as, you know, the Twitter, Facebook? Yeah. How they get, get with you, G? My Twitter, I need some, some shot town followers, man. You already know. It's uh, it's twitter.com slash J. Cole NC, mm -hmm. like North Carolina. All right. So follow me. Or y'all can go to J. Cole fans uh -huh. uh, And they'll be, they be up on my movements, man. They keep right. it. That's what it is, man. Mr. Who That, J. Cole in studio, 773-375-92 for you. It's your Hot Boys. We'll be right back. 92, man. Hot Boys doing it up, man. About to let J. Cole get ready to move around a little bit before we let him go, man. Got some more questions for the homie, man. What is the name of the new album? Are you working on it? What, what's good? Yeah, I'm still working on it. I got the name, but I just ain't put it out yet. I want to kind of shoot this little trailer and do it, All right. do it like that before I put it out. I'm almost done, but okay. it's, it's hard when you try to promote a single mm -hmm. and finish the album at the same time. It usually didn't work like that. You just do your album and then you go hit the road, but yeah. you know, I'm trying to juggle the two. 
So I appreciate all the love on the who that man, but we got some we got some crazy. I'm gonna play for y'all too so we got the air. I'm gonna let y'all hear. Yeah, we wanna hear something. Let us hear something so we can tell get people bubbling about it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yo, check it out, man. Like, like since you fresh in the game, what artists like you looking forward to working with? You know what I'm saying? Throughout your career, somebody you really wanna get out with? Andre 3000, man. Kanye West, of course. Um, you know, Eminem one day, Alicia Keys, Lauryn Hill. Uh, you know, Nas, I really want to work with Nas. I feel like I can produce a classic for Nas, you know, if okay. he was to ever let me. Right, put it out there. Yeah, absolutely. So it's a bunch of, man, a bunch of legends I want to work with before they decide they don't want to do it no more. Right, right, yeah. right. Yeah. You no know, doubt everybody started doing movies and stuff, yeah, man, you know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> I didn't realize how good the movie money is. Right, hey, yeah, I ain't mad at that. <laughs> hey, man, um, real quick, I got to ask you for North Carolina, Duke or North, or North Carolina? Oh, man, you already know the answer to that. Oh, no, uh, what is it? Absolutely. Yeah. Come on! Oh, man. Number 23, watching the short end. I'm a Duke fan. Nah, we we're, get both of y'all. We go with the powder blue. <laughs> no That's doubt. Crazy, though. You know what? I, I really, uh, you know, I ain't going to speak on it because I don't want to mess up no shows, no further shows. I'm going to be booking people. Right, 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 right. right. Get that I'm bread. Gonna, yeah, absolutely. But yeah, I'm a, I'm a Carolina Tar Heel. All right, no doubt, no doubt, man. Hey, dog, man. Much success to you, man. I know we're going to come back see you again when the album get going, G. Hey, 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 man, keep light skin alive, G. Absolutely, man. We're coming back, dog. <laughs> there it is, man. The homie J. Cole. Give it up for him, man. Anytime, right. fam, man. Thank Appreciate you, you boy. Yeah. Appreciate y'all.